The first thing you need to do is go here. This part's pretty fucking easy, but you'd be surprised how stupid some people are. So, uh, I gotta leave this map up for a long fucking time so you numb fucks can get it. This next bit is pretty exciting, so prepare yourself. Just walk up this hill that goes over the tunnel. Told you. Riveting. So, how's life? Probably terrible. I know mine is. You know, I'm really enjoying this free time we're getting together. Not really, though. I hate you. Once you get to this little gap, just slide inside. I would say be careful, because it's easy to fall, but I couldn't give a fuck. Then just hug the wall and walk along this ledge. Be sure to crouch down. It makes it easier, obviously. Now just gracefully slide down to the other ledge. No! Okay, with any luck, hopefully you won't fall off the cliff and you'll land down here. Just continue along this path. You're gonna have to do some jumping. It's pretty neato. And more walking. Just don't fall off here because you'll die. Or do. I dare you, fact. Now, coming up here, there's a pretty big ledge you have to jump onto. Whew. Bar barely made that one. After tackling that, you should be ready to jump this gap. You want to land right there. God fuck it. Damn it! Uh, once again, with any luck, you'll land down here on this ledge, and you can keep going. Uh, if you fell off, then your life's pathetic, and you're gonna have to start all over again. Now all you're gonna have to do is jump this gap. If you fall here, you're 100% fucked, and boom, easy. Piece of fucking god, no, no, no! Fuck! <sighs> it's been a few hours now, as you can tell by the sun being all bright and shit. Let's try this one more time. At least it better be one more time. Or I sent some buckshot going through my skull in the near future. Now that you cleared this gap on your first try, just walk forward and jump into the train. And in the bottom of it, you'll find the gold. And a few tonics that give you dead eye XP and stamina XP. Uh, now you can chug those bitches now, or I would probably save them for later, because they give you 25% towards your next level. So they'll be way more useful when it's hard to level up, but you know, I know none of you fucks are gonna listen, so why am I even trying? I don't fucking know. There's also some stuff in the other car, in this chest. You can get that shit. Obviously, if you sell it too, it's worth about a hundred something dollars. You can sell all this shit at a fence. There's one located in Emerald Ranch. Despite the name, this ranch resembles horse shit more than it does an emerald, but that's besides the point. And all, you can get around $1,100 from this. Is it worth it? Probably not, but you already watched the video, so I get the ad revenue. Uh, like the video, subscribe if you want. I don't really care either way. You're insignificant, and I won't miss you. Bye.